We have a couple more side quests in there as well. We pick up. We all have our place. Some Osaram girl applied to the city guard. Everyone needs a splash of color in their lives. Come, let's talk it over. And this second. Able bodied adventurers! Outlander! Are you looking for. Wait. I know your face. <laughs> you came back! <laughs> How did we fare? Expensively. <sighs> That's what I was afraid of. The tame machines. It's hard to explain, but there was a kind of signal that calmed them. Your men got greedy, so it's gone now. Gambling's a shoddy job, girl. I should have been a weapons dealer. That's steady work. Here, take it. The half I'd owed those hammer-handed chunks. Half? I finished the job. And what was it you said? Enough to buy a more becoming garb? <laughs> what do you want? Carja silks? Ah. <sighs> Hoisted on my own purse strings. Let's also, hand this one back in. Well met. On this is. This one. Where's Talana? Maybe upstairs. Damn, this is fire. No assist either. Maybe Ligon knows where they are. You have trophies? I can hang on to them until the Sunhawk returns. Where are Assis and Talana? Are oh, you going after Red Hawk? Received or word Red about Red yeah. Maw and rushed out. Talana found out a short time later and had to follow. They both went alone? Assis left without his thrush. Talana did as well. Though, I saw some outlanders follow after her. I wouldn't put it past Assis to try something underhanded to get the kill. Where have they gone? I have to help if I can. Hmm. You might be right. They've gone southeast, headed for the spear shafts. You'd better hurry. Okay. No one's handed in anyway. Oh, XP. There's blood on the throne because of Jaron, but Avad is trying to wash it clean. Okay, we need a armor merchant. Town. I have family who fled the sun. So I have the resources to make uh, potions, so we're just gonna buy some potions. Out of business. So I need to bow it back up for that. I've loads of chill bars. Fifty, a hundred, one fifty, two, three hundred, three hundred and ten. I feel like we just have a lot of crap. Might need this. Oh, 
How do I go there? He can you there! Can you help me? Just a moment of your time. You're the one the Vanguard has been crowing about. The Nora who tracks criminals and traitors with her second sight. If only you'd use it to help me. A thief raided my home and took my brother's sword. I'll investigate. I'll see sure, what I will. can do about the robbery. Have a word with my steward if you need to. He saw the thief escape. And listen, all I want is the sword back. Meridian, and my family for that matter, has seen enough strife already. If I can get it back, all is forgiven. No retribution necessary. Okay. I've had occasion to debate a Nora before. Might be fun. Where the more will feel like home. Up here. She said her lover was killed by a machine. Your Nora. I'm the mournful Naman. My apologies that we meet like this. Like this? In grief, you hold yours close, like a talisman. Wait, forgive me. You didn't come for reparations? Someone you lost to the Sun Ring? Oh, no. I know about the Red Raids, but the Karja owe me nothing. I see. Well, I could use the help of a strong-willed outlander. Then I would owe you very much indeed. These people seek to honor their loved, their lost, with their own voices, not mouthing Karja rituals to Karja stone. But there are obstacles. And while Meridian holds its breath for any disturbance, these robes only tie my hands. How can I help? help? What must be done? The first pilgrim is an Asaram who seeks to visit the Shrine of Kings on the road to the city. He waits there now. Forbidden to enter by an old sun priest who suffer no heathen. This Utaro lost her companion on the edge of the jewel, at a pool where snap moths gather. A shrine was built there to ward off the machines, and its effectiveness leaves much to be desired. And the Manuk would paint a mark on the sun's climb. A call to the machine spirits, I understand. They need no beckoning. Glindhawks perched there, drawn to the spire's shining. So, clear the machines out of two shrines and move a priest out of the other. All I can ask for is your charity and that their stories are heard. I'll do what I can to help those in mourning. To honor their memories is to honor us all. Okay, bit of a weird one, but sure. Save on the way past. Damn, Osaram. Stirring up tensions. Keep my eyes open. There's a gun. You saw the thief make a run for it? My back was to the wall, you see? Wasn't expecting someone to crawl out the window. He ran past me, dressed in grey, clutching the sword. That's all I saw. By the sun, my heart nearly seized up. Where is the crime scene? Is this all just a crime scene? Arrested two Drops of blood leading away. More blood. I'm still on the trail. 
couldn't imagine living anywhere else. Still more blood. The thief got cut. Well, the trail ends here. But someone must have seen the thief. Did someone run past here, holding a sword? Sure did. He grabbed some linen off the stand here and took off down the stairs behind you. He was bleeding, so maybe he needed a binding. Blast it! That was expensive cloth. I can't believe I paid for that thief's bandage. Went to the market, slipped on some fruit. Such a hard life. If the thief came this way, there's only one way he could have gone. Forward. No sign of the thief. Someone was- Did you see anyone run through here? He would have been holding a sword. Yeah. Almost crashed into me, too. He ran down the parapet here and went down the lift. No way you'll catch him now. I didn't see a sword, though. He wasn't carrying anything. Not a damn thing. Just ran like his ass was on fire. The thief must have ditched the sword. But where? Maybe he had help. That merchant stall would have been a convenient drop-off. Another freehold in the south. When will it end? Oh, gone by now. It looks like the thief got away, but without the sword. I thought maybe he dropped it off somewhere. Like here, for instance? What? No. I had nothing to do with this. I guess we'll see when I get the city guard to toss your stall and question your customers. Uh, hold on. There's more to this. You've got a reputation for shining light in the darkness, so I know you'll listen. You're right. The sword was passed to me, and I passed it on to someone else. It's going to be sold, but not for profit. The shards will go to people in need. You expect me to believe that? I can prove it. Meet my friends at the water mill in the lower village. They'll explain everything. If they don't convince you, come right back with the guards. I'm not going anywhere. It wouldn't matter if you did. I'd find you. <sighs> but all right. I'll check out the water mill. Okay. I guess I should go to this water mill then to find out what's nope. going. If it's down the bottom, we'll uh, travel down so much quicker. I don't get about the sun dump. All these fancy decorations everywhere. It's downright embarrassing. I miss mainspring. That's not like freaking Geralt. I thought that was something blue, but it wasn't. Is it just me or hard to pass? Sometimes a body needs to rest. Just wish I could do it more often. I was told to expect you, Aloy. I suppose you want answers. Well, it's not complicated. We collect valuable objects from people who don't need them, sell them for shards, and use the money to help the needy at Sunfall. What do you expect me to do now? Walk away? I was hoping you'd help us. They say you can track like a stalker. Well, my partner, Nassan, disappeared near the branded shore. He was bound for Sunfall, along with an entire shipment of food. If you found that, you'd be helping a lot of people. I'll consider it. But only if you return the sword to Ravon. I knew you were gonna say that. Fine, I'll return the damn blade. Nassan was supposed to meet his contact at an old campfire on the fork near the branded shore. Start looking there. But be careful. Lots of machines out there, and lots of shadow karja. And not the needy kind, but they're tormentors. Yes. Quest is getting longer and longer.
No, it's miles away, so... Okay, two of them are really, oh, all three of them are quite close, actually. One of them did have pretty really snap moles on it, though. Ideal. this one because it's at the lake. Oh, something else in. Red light means trouble. How did that one hit me? I hate the double hits. I'm the wrong arrow, that's why nothing's working. Resistant. I guess that makes sense. Well, hey. Oh, perfect. Too bad considering. <sighs> Just go to all the greens. Did 
Where the camp is out this way? It's over there. This is where the Otaru wanted to say her goodbyes. destroy his belly when he's underwater. It's super annoying. Oh. I was getting hit by the other one. Probably not weak to tear. Am I getting this completely wrong? I know you can see what it's weak to, but not when I'm in the middle of two fights. That's tear, isn't it? Or whatever, but hard point to not tear. It's a bit of a tear. A tear that's not tear. Yeah, but these are like armor piercing fucking arrows or some shit. I hate how they can shoot in front of where you're rolling to as well. Pissing or whatever it is. Hard point. Talking to you went there a minute ago. When we fled from our cages during the liberation, I tore through this clearing, thinking my friend was behind me. 
I kept running. But here she remains. Thank you for making it safe for me to return. I don't want to rush you, but it won't stay safe for long. I understand. I've done this before in waking dreams. In the pool, I'll find the bracelet of seeds she dropped when she fell. The seeds will be split, escaped, grown wild. She's passing from my memory into the jungles. I'll tell her it was I who died here and became a stranger in our own land, and she who still lives in every time of planting, of rains, harvests, and... Oh. What is it? There. Her bracelet. And... I thought she was behind me. But there's only my reflection. Do you need to be alone? For the first time, I am. Wow, that was cheery. Oh, useful. Let's grab this campfire. A villager over here? Was that the one we were at before? That's a really stupid place for a campfire. 